see some ID. Why? I want you to go in and end mine. Oh, not me. <laughs> what do you mean, not me? Yes. Ah! That's karma, bitch. Hi guys, how are you? I do miss if I taught this video, I'm gonna make a new mood reaction. At first, I was thinking of doing Rocky, but it's only available on Amazon Prime and I don't have Amazon Prime. So, 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 yeah, and using my VPN, I found Rumble on Netflix Canada, so I'm gonna watch that. <laughs> Life is full of surprises, including this one. The only thing in common is that it's starring by Sylvester Stallone, so... I hope you enjoyed this movie. If you want to check the full reaction, that is my patron. So, I don't have any much to say. I know it's about a war. Or, I don't know, it's an action movie. That's the only thing I know about it. So, let's make the reaction. Mario Kassar and Andrew Dugu. Sebastian Stallone. I can't believe this is the first movie that I react to it. Starting by Sylvester Stallone. What? First blood. It means Rambo. Right? <laughs> what if I'm watching the wrong movie? That would be hilarious. This is 1982. He was so young. Is this before Rocky? I don't know. Well, Sylvester co wrote this movie. Can you tell me this is where Delmar Barry lives? He ain't here. What happened to him? Like I said, he's a friend. Uh, my name is John Rambo. We serve. Yeah, the same Rambo. Team. So I'm watching the right movie. <laughs> Good. That's me. That's uh, Danforth and Westmore, Bronson, Ortega, and there's Delmar right in the back. Delmar's gone. Um, like he died? He died. What? Died last summer. Yeesh. Cancer. Always oh, the freaking cancer. Do you hear that Olivia Newton died of cancer? Hopelessly to put it to you. I'm still sad. I could lift him off the sheet. Yikes. That is a rough way to find out that your friend died. Okay. Morning, Dave. Hi, Sheriff. Gonna take a bath this week? <laughs> Morning. You visiting somebody around here? Because he's dead. You're wearing that flag on that jacket. You're asking for trouble around here, friend. You're headed north or south. I'll make sure you're heading the right direction, huh? So far, so good. I don't have an idea where the plot's going. <laughs> Which is interesting. I'm not complaining. I'm just wondering. You got some place I can eat around here? There's a diner about 30 miles up the highway. Is there any law against me getting something here? Yeah, me. So why are you pushing me? I haven't done anything to you. First of all, you don't ask the questions around here. I do. You understand? Okay. Secondly, we don't want guys like you in this town. What's the problem with him? Drifters. You know, that's kind of discriminatory. And I get paid to keep it that way. Yeah, if you want some friendly advice, a haircut and take a bath. You wouldn't get hassled so much. Hope this ride helped you out. What's wrong with his hair? It's the 80s. That's quite normal, right? Have a nice day, huh? <laughs> Have a nice day. He's going back. Why? Ah, son of a bitch. Where the hell do you think you're going? Let me see some ID. Ooh. Right, you're under arrest. Why? You hear me? You put your hands on the car. He didn't do anything. Now you're going to put your hands on that car. What the fuck? <sighs> if stairs could kill. Get him back. I don't understand. You try to be nice to some people. He hasn't said anything. We have here, huh? 
Oh, nice. Why would you be carrying a knife like this? Auntie. I got it, me. That's kind of suspicious. Hey, Will. Just another smart ass drifter. I want you to book this gentleman for vagrancy, resisting arrest, carrying a concealed weapon. He didn't resist the arrest. <clears throat> I hate the abuse of power. Like, what the fuck? Let's just see if you can clean him up a little bit. All right, I'm gonna Sounds like an animal. Mitch, yo. Escort this young man downstairs, with you? Oh, yes, sir, Mr. Gall. You gotta admit that he's acting really strange. Like, he's looking around. He's pretty quiet. Yeah, that's kind of odd. But I don't think he's a criminal. Okay, here we go. Name? Your name? Why isn't he speaking? What? If you're looking for trouble, you came to the right place, buddy. Hey, you got three seconds before I break your face in. What the fuck? Why is everybody so aggressive? Oh, Harry, here's the soldier. Rambo. John Jay? Promise you're gonna talk to me, soldier. Starting to dislike you. Look. It won't work that way, it'll only smear and I'll run it across. Look, you son of a bitch. You don't put your goddamn hand down there, I'm gonna break it off. He won't let us print him, Will. Leave the ink on the hand. <laughs> what is your problem, huh? As things stand right now, you're facing the ass end of a 90-day incarceration plus a $250 fine, which you don't look to me like you can pay. At 10 o'clock tomorrow morning, you're going up in front of that judge. He didn't do shit, and you're talking about taking him in front of a judge? Why? <laughs> I mean, I get he's acting odd and all, but he hasn't said anything. Oh, that's so scary. Now we're gonna make you a little bit more presentable for your courtroom appearance. Holy shit, look at this. What the hell's he been into? Does he has marks? Oh, shit. Christ. He's been tortured. <laughs> Get putas! Oh, Why the fuck, the fuck did you do that? Well a man said clean him up. What on the <sighs> I want to punch that jackass right in the fucking face. <sighs> Come on, Rambo. You can stand up and kick his ass. <sighs> well, a man said clean him up. <sighs> clean him up. Hey, Preston! <laughs> Don't forget that to is abuse. The How you like that, huh? What's the matter, Mitch? Don't you like water sports? <laughs> no, he doesn't like abuse because he seems like a nice guy. Like a nice policeman, unlike you. All right, hurry it up. It's time for my coffee break. Sit down. Oh, it's been fantastic. We just took the hard way. Jesus Christ. Can't you see this guy's crazy? Can't you see? Oh. I don't give a shit. Oh! Come on, let me Yeah, he's kind of delusional. I get it's PTSD, but, 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 but why didn't you say that in the first place? You could have saved yourself so much trouble, like getting prison. I'm not saying that it was fair, but but at least he could have said something. Not the eyes. <laughs> Okay, now you have to admit that you're 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 doing something illegal. You're attacking policemen. <laughs> that is not helping you, Rambo. What the fuck? <laughs> I don't understand anything yet. And I'm gonna try to shut the fuck up. Oh my god. He's gonna escape. You could have done that 
at the beginning, you know? Wow. Try! Try, Quimbo! What? What the fuck? Wow, that is so dope. Oh, that poor car. Whoa. That was a bad idea, Paul. And he's gonna help him? Ah, uh, he's fine. I'm thinking you're not that good of a sheriff. What the fuck happened here? That was pretty stupid too. Echo, 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 echo. He's up there beyond the draw. Bitch, get Orville on the radio. Tell him to get out of here with his damn dogs right away. We'll get him. No problem. Mm -hmm. I'm still thinking that he could have saved himself so much trouble. He just could have lied or say, yeah, why should have, have a nice day, or say anything at all. And he wouldn't have ended up in prison or escaping. The fuck is that? Dangerous? He's just dumb. <laughs> <laughs> kind of agree. <laughs> Hear me out. My understanding is PTSD, whatever. But damn, he handled the situation so wrong. This is no good. Why? There were three of us on him in the cell block down there. He went through us like we weren't even there. <laughs> Is he gonna jump? No, that is no way. Okay, now there is a helicopter. Okay, don't you think you're even reacting a little bit? <laughs> Why do you spend so much budget by chasing just one person? Like a helicopter? I thought that was a small town. <laughs> Shit. How are you gonna hide from the heli helicopter? There he is, on the cliff. Mm -hmm. He's gonna jump. That policeman is crazy. Galt. Galt. I hate Galt. I, I hope he dies. I still don't understand the plot of this movie, but hell, he's such a moron. You don't buy this thing, right? I swear to God, I will kill you. He has a problem. You need therapy. I got it. Este güey tiene esta tremenda mala puntería, ¿qué? Come on, dude. If you're gonna be a jackass, at least do it right. <laughs> He's gonna jump. Uy. You're not Arnold Schwarzenegger. You're not gonna survive. Ay, Jesus Christ. Yeah, I know, right? Jesus. 
Oh, the alarm. Ah, son of a bitch. Yes! That's karma, bitch! Are you really gonna check on him? Shit! I don't think it was such a good idea that you took his clothes! Are you telling me that you have a needle inside the freaking knife the entire time? What? I'm so confused. <laughs> Maria. Oh, is it? Eh. Holy shit. I love the practical effects, you know? Ah! Oh, you know, anesthesia? What the fuck is wrong with you? How do you fall out? What's the matter? This nailed his sucker's ass. He can't be fought. Looks like he wants to turn himself in. What? There's one man dead. It's not my fault. I don't want any more hurt. I'm warning you, boy. Don't make a move. I'll blow your head off. I didn't do anything. Exactly. Oh. What the fuck, dude? Okay, first of all. He's kind of right. He didn't do anything at the beginning, but then he he went all like crazy mood and started kicking everybody and running away. That's illegal. So you did do something, but the, the now they're shooting him. Is is a little bit over the top? Yes. Lord, God damn it! Cease fire! Take me hit him. All right, let's yeah. get down there. What a hell of a guy to mess around with. John Rambo is a Vietnam vet. He's a Green Beret, Congressional Medal of Honor. Guy's a war hero. I knew there was something about that guy. Yeah, me too. Green Beret, war hero. That's great. That's you just great. Your <laughs> okay, that's the only sheriff I like. <laughs> the nicest one. Now what the hell's the matter with you guys? He's one man. He's wounded. Those Green Berets. They're real badasses. Why don't you let the state police handle this? <laughs> what the fuck, dude? Look at him. Look at him. It's our gold boy. I. Ugh. This is getting on my nerves. He was just telling the truth. So don't you. You don't have any right to be that fucking rude with him. That is abuse. I know you're the boss, but that doesn't give you the right to be so fucking rude. <sighs> I thought I was gonna have a good time with this movie. Laugh a little. Enjoy fighting scenes. The silly plots. But what the heck? I'm so irritated. I'm furious. He and I were friends when your mama was still wiping your nose. Now he's dead. He's dead because of that psycho. No, he's dead because that guy went all psycho killer. I mean, he... he Practically jump out of the helicopter. It's gonna storm. That's all we need now. Mm -hmm. no. Come on, let's get out of here before it gets too dark. What's exactly. I really like the red headed. And I don't know his name. They're waiting for you. Mitch. Get on your, Mitch. Feet. Get on your feet and move. There he is. Turn those dogs loose, Hubble. Go get him, sweet eyes. I don't see shit, okay? Oh my god! Jesus. He's got a gun. Oh, yes. It's not him. It's a goddamn scarecrow. <laughs> scarecrow just shot Orville. He's close. Go get him, Maggie. The dog is gonna die. Oh, poor dog. We gotta get this guy to a doctor. We God damn it, get your belt on there fast. Where's the first aid kit? I left it in the car. <laughs> Shit, is that ammo? How do you know that? Because whatever killed that last dog was no bullet, that's how. Hurry up. Get Come the on. son of a bitch. Go. Go get it. 
<laughs> They're getting all over their heads. Clearly, the guy is pretty dangerous. I will call, I don't know, the federal police and get some help because they're just forming five. Too smart. We ain't hunting him. He's hunting us. <laughs> I don't care about anybody here. Just me. What the hell did he do? No, Mitch! No, Mitch! Mitch! Don't tell me he's dead. Ah, ha, ha. He's hunting them. One by one. Ay, Marika, no, Mitch! Was it Mitch? I don't think Rambo is such a good person. Oh my god, Ish! That is savage! You should have called somebody. Don't you have radio? A walkie or something? Oh my god. I could have killed them all. I could have killed you. In town, you the law. Not here, it's me. Son of a bitch. Don't push it, I'll give you a war you won't believe. Let it go. Yeah, Bron. Get the hell away from there. That's a scary. Rumble is mental. I thought he was gonna be like kind of a hero, but no! He's a traumatized dude. And a dangerous one. Somewhere in this rugged mountain countryside, possibly above the snow line, shrouded in mist, the fugitive John Rambo is hiding. Only their skill training and police enforcement techniques saved their lives. And we're now... <laughs> that is a good joke. They're alive because he wanted them to survive. <sighs> I'm so stressed, man. I keep saying it and I'm gonna keep saying it and I'm gonna be so fucking annoying for the rest of this movie. The whole conflict of the movie could have been avoided so easily. <laughs> I don't understand the fact that it happened. Okay, at the beginning, Rumble, yeah, arrived to his friend's house and he died. Yeah, he, he was probably upset. But what was his purpose then? Like, where was he gonna go? He wanted to go to his family or what? And that's why he got so pissed that he got incarcerated or what? I don't understand it. I guess it's not supposed to be overthinking, but 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 what? <laughs> where is the logic in this? But the fugitive will be in custody in a matter of hours. <laughs> I don't think so, Paul. I was just talking to Mitch, and he was saying that. Galton and a couple of deputies were uh, a little hard on the guy. Assholes. Doesn't make one goddamn bit of difference, David. It does! <sighs> I'm so frustrated. Yeah, they were overstepping. They were being abusive with someone. I don't care if he was a criminal. Like, you can't treat people that way. And he didn't even say anything. And you treated him like shit. So that is fucking karma. The only one I feel sorry about is Mitch. Doesn't make one goddamn bit of difference, Dave, and you know it. One of my deputies gets out of line with a prisoner, then the prisoner comes to me with it. And if what? I find out it's like he says, I kicked the deputy's ass. Oh, yeah, yeah. Right. Around with the law and all hell breaks loose. Then in the first place, you shouldn't abuse the freaking prisoners. I have a possessed God in heaven to make a man like Rambo. God didn't make Rambo. I made him. We're a little busy this morning, Colonel. What can I do for you? I've come to get my boy. Rambo's a civilian now. He's my problem. I didn't come here to rescue Rambo from you. I came here to rescue you from him. <laughs> we'll try to be extra careful. The guy put a fucking knife into your throat, like almost slashing you, and you still think that you can get him? I mean, <laughs> this is delusional. You're being naive or maybe idiotic. You're lucky to be breathing. Exactly. Great. 
Okay, Colonel, now you got us all scared to death. What, what do you and the special forces think I ought to do about your psycho out there? Let him go. Do what? Do you want a war you can't win? Are you telling me that 200 men against your boy is a no-win situation for us? You send that many, don't forget one thing. What? A good supply of body bags. Are you gonna hunt him down and kill, uh, eat it? Por favor, dime que, que lo vas a hacer. Yeah, thank God. Yeah, it's a trap, but I'm not worried about Rambo. They're all gone, sir. It's him. Get on it. Baker team, they're all dead, sir. Not Delmore Barry. He made it. Barry's gone too, sir. Can't say him down to the bone. I'm the last one, sir. Hey, it's good to hear your voice, Johnny. I tried to get in touch with you, but the guys at Bragg never knew where to find you. Yeah, well, I haven't been spending much time there lately. Well, look, John, we can't have you running around out there wasting friendly civilians. There are no friendly civilians. Seems like bailing you out of trouble is going to be a lifetime job for me. There wouldn't be no trouble except for that king shit cup. All I wanted was something to eat. But the man kept pushing, sir. Ah. They drew first blood, not me. I agree with him. Now knowing this changes a little bit my perspective of the movie. Yeah, he's a traumatized man. He was looking for his partners and they're all dead. And he feels alone. Yes, and they push him. He was already on the verge of the edge. So, so yeah, I get why he is not out that way. Okay, this is an interesting movie. He's okay, yes. No, no, he's just a kid. There's a guy in What happened, son? Over there. Over there. I Where? see him over there. I'll get him, I'll get him. Don't shoot, cool down. This way, let's go. Okay. If the guy is that dangerous, why didn't you put a restraint order of the area? You know, why are they civilians hunting around there? <sighs> Woo! He's had a Come on, guys, shoot! Come on! I thought they were dead. I want you and Bruce head around these trees, go to the front of that mine. Screw that, Clinton. I ain't going up there. <laughs> I want you to go into that mine. Oh, not me. <laughs> what do you mean, not me? He's probably in there just waiting for us. Mm -hmm. What's wrong with you, Clinton? <laughs> <laughs> Is that a bazooka? Did you take a bazooka to catch a guy? I don't believe it. Idiots. <laughs> All right, Nick, one more for soldiers. Are you forge. fucking kidding me? What the hell do you think this is? Some kind of a circus? <laughs> Get the hell out of here! Well, he was shooting at us, Will. Come on, I wasn't taking any chances. <laughs> of course he's fucking alive. Because there are four more movies. Or five. I wonder how this movie is going to end. What's going to be the big final battle? Probably him killing them all. You think Rambo was the only guy who had a tough time in Vietnam? He killed a police officer for Christ's sake. Yeah, he did it. <laughs> and the, the 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 helicopter driver. He he can testify that the idiot killed himself. Yeah, goddamn lucky he didn't kill all of you. He knows he's alive. <laughs> Ah! 
Be careful. <gasps> oh, the rats are on top of him. No, mommies. Oh, oh, are they biting him? Oh, so it. Ew. so bad I could taste it. Why? Because he humiliated you? Kind of a way. <laughs> he didn't do anything. Huh. Pretty convenient. Ah. Shit. How is he gonna get away? Drive. Don't look at me, look at the road. <laughs> That's how accidents happen. Okay? Robert, oh, get out of the truck. I got no beef with you. No. Go on, move, go home! Relax, you're gonna survive. He's immortal. You should drive faster. Why are they so violent? You should shoot for the tires, damage the car, not kill the person. Well, he has the bigger car. What the heck? They weren't even driving that fast to cause that explosion. God damn it. He's not gonna stop. Do you really think he's gonna stop? Why? You're just calling the attention. Oh, okay. And all the budget of the movie went to that shot. <laughs> Are you sure nobody was there? Holy fuck! Right, get out there right away. Move! And they're gonna think he died, so happy ending for everybody. What the hell is going on? How? How's the logic in this? It looks cool though. Attention all civilians. For your own safety, please evacuate the streets immediately. They evacuated so fast. <laughs> when I talked to you earlier this afternoon, you knew he was still alive, didn't you? You taught him how to get out of places like that cave. Well, there was a stair, so it was pretty easy. Now, what makes you think you can handle him now? Because God knows to do everything's happening because of the fucking sheriff's pride you're gonna die diesel everybody dies the truck's out here but we couldn't find the body i repeat no body it's totally burned out Come on, the man just wants to escape. Why don't you let him? What the fuck? Oh. 
Now I don't understand. Why don't you just escape? Do you want revenge? Not because you know the freaking guys in the roof. Well, that was pretty easy. I don't feel bad for you at all. Not even in this light list. I like this, that the whole movie is so stressful and confusing, but they making us feel how he's feeling, you know? Uh, yeah, he needs to let it all out, he needs to crumble, yes, he needs to explode. I had a friend who was the Air Force, but I had all these guys, man, because back here there's nothing. Hmm. Remember the Air Force? When this bar in Saigon, and this kid comes up, this kid carrying a sushi giant box. I went to get a couple of beers, and the, the box is wired, and he opened up the box, fucking oh. blew his body all over the place, and there's pieces of them all over me, just like, like this, and I'm trying to pull them off, you know, and it's, it's my friend that's all over me. He needs therapy. I want to go home, Johnny. I want to drive my Chevy. I said, well, what? I can't find your fucking legs. I can't find your legs. Damn, who would have thought this movie was going to be deep? I don't have wire headphones anymore. <laughs> I can't laugh without coughing. <sighs> Shit. This was deep. I mean, the best part of the movie was the freaking ending. That last scene explains a lot. Okay. Maybe that scene changed my perspective of the movie. I was like, what is this? But yeah. This is basically the movie of a deranged man that didn't get therapy or the proper help he needed when he came back from the war. Shit. Well, that scene wasn't like the best acted, but shit. Like, I get it. I don't know, I'm speechless. I, I totally understand his point of view. Imagine getting back from the war. You just want peace. You just want to find a purpose. But you're so traumatized that you can't even find a stable job. That everybody, yeah, in normal life, people are rude. So you're just frustrated. And, 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 and yeah, I know. I get why he snapped. Of course, and after that police abuse, of course he was gonna say, fuck it. <laughs> Who would have thought this, go this was gonna be deep? <sighs> I'm still not sure if I liked it or not, but it's interesting. Yeah. Damn. 
there. Or maybe I'm just overthinking it. <laughs> it made me feel bad for him. <laughs> I know there's like five movies of this, so he's probably gonna get to jail, but he's gonna get the help he needs. And then there's gonna be a mission where they're gonna be like, we need him. Yeah. But I feel quite sad. Poor Rambo. So thanks for watching, guys. Please let me comment your opinions about the movie, about my reaction. <sighs> yeah, because we need to talk about this movie. <laughs> uh, and yeah, if you want me to watch the sequel, I will do it if this video gets at least 15,000 views. And yeah, don't forget to subscribe to give it a like to read the notification bell to get the notification of my videos. And if you want to follow me on my social network insights, uh -huh, uh -huh, uh -huh. and of course, if you want to watch the full reaction of this, that is my Patreon, and you can also watch the full reaction of um, Lucifer, Stranger Things, yeah, season four, just season four, uh, and, and all the other movie reactions, yeah. <laughs> Love you. Bye.